Okay. Today we are going to cut our hair. I've been cutting my own hair literally for as long as I can remember, at least for the past at least for the past 10 years, no other person has cut my hair. It is a wash. Oh, no, 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 baby. I washed it yesterday night, night before. So tonight would be the night I would wash my hair. Before I cut it, I like to straighten it. And before I straighten it, <laughs> <laughs> I put in this Not no when I put that in I go from here down. I never go up on my roots because That part I don't like to Make oily especially have to wear my hair for the rest of the day and then I go in with this after <laughs> Because it's really rare when I do Use a flat iron on my hair or a straightener. So my hair is long. Like it for reference, this is where it ends. <laughs> right here. We're also 30 weeks pregnant. We made it this far. As for 30 week symptoms, it's been a doozy. I've actually had quite a bit of fainting spells in the past two weeks than I've had in the first six weeks of pregnancy and I don't understand why. So, also have my glucose test a few weeks back. That came back good. I've also been gone not updating anything because I've been super busy with work stuff to the point where I don't have time to even sleep. So, now that work is pretty much done for me, Thinking about to doing what I want to do. Also, this is me at 30 weeks, like, and this is I weigh more right now at 30 weeks than I did when I was than I did when I gave birth to my second child. <laughs> That's a little rubber band. Okay, so the way I cut my hair is I just put it in little rubber bands to cut the length and then I go and I flip it all forward and then cut that again. So I just rubber band it to keep it all one length in one spot. Like I said, this is, I'm gonna try and get my hair cut by somebody. So I'm not too worried about it being crooked or it coming out looking like a hot mess because I wear my hair up in a bun anyways. And also I, I'm gonna get it fixed after my baby's born. So where the rubber band is, I just cut right above it. a solid two and a half inches after that I just hold it open and I go down the side or down the middle now I used to do this all the way up here to get all the layers but <laughs> 
as I've gotten over, I've been over the whole layering thing, like dramatic layers, so I really don't care. Like I said, I normally wear my hair up in a bun anyways. I'm not going to cut too much off lengthwise. Pulled it all forward, and then this, after pulling it forward, that is what I cut off. And then I do it again where I grab it all forward, and I cut like that, just randomly, to get the ends all squared away. <coughs> and that's... That's about it, that's how I cut my hair. This is where it's at now. Which still, like I said, for most people this is really long. For me this is like mid length, any shorter and it's too short for me. I've just always had long hair my whole life. And keeping it long is what I like best. Yes. Yes, I am done. Mm -hmm.